This is extremely dangerous to our democracy. This is extremely dangerous to our democracy. This is extremely dangerous to our democracy. In a now viral video, anchors from Sinclair news stations read the same promotional script denouncing so-called false news. Some media outlets publish these same fake stories without checking facts first. One false story after another. The message seems to echo President Trump's criticism of news coverage. We are not going to let the fake news tell us what to do. The owners of Sinclair Broadcast Group have donated thousands to Republican causes, including a super PAC supporting Mr. Trump's 2016 presidential bid. Obamacare is not presently sustainable. Last year, the company hired former Trump White House staff member Boris Epstein as its chief political analyst. I want to talk to you about my job. Sinclair stations are required to carry Epstein segments, including this one where he defends his role. Wouldn't you want someone talking to you about politics only if you had actually worked in politics? On Twitter, President Trump called Sinclair far superior to other media companies and mocked those who criticized Sinclair for being biased. His comments raised questions about White House impartiality as the Justice Department and the FCC review Sinclair's attempted acquisition of Tribune Media. If approved, the deal would increase Sinclair's reach to around 72 percent of American households. This is similar to AT&T's proposed acquisition of Time Warner. The president frequently bashed CNN, a Time Warner property, and his Justice Department is trying to block that deal. But the judge, who is currently overseeing the case that will decide whether or not that deal can go forward, has not really allowed the president's influence to be examined during the trial. Paula Reed, CBS News, Washington.